Welcome, welcome. Alright, here's another cop watching training video of something that my buddy did that I really, really love. Uh, he was threatened by police, real close proximity, way too close in the hallway, and instead of just face to facing him, he turned around and did that whole over the shoulder uh, look to make sure it documented if he uh, was touched or pushed or grabbed or any of that. The cop did put his hands on him, did threaten him arrest with arrest twice. So this is just a real quick video to show exactly what I'm talking about when I say turn around and film them over your shoulder. Someone calling us around, but for the most part, um, everyone has pretty much left me alone. He's just doing an audit of a city hall, just walking around. The ladies around. have been real nice. Usually it's the ladies that freak out, but um, <laughs> the ladies have definitely done their thing. Oh, my fear means you're right, suspicious. So it doesn't look like we can get out here. This is a fire door. It looks like the only way we can get out. It's the same way we came from. He's trying to leave. I might be wrong. He's actually trying to leave the building right now. Like, just not a whole lot was going on. Young lady. So now somebody's got a little freaked out because he brought a camera in. They're not used to seeing cameras. That woman right there with the phone. All right, see, she just pressed the panic button. <laughs> Over what? Over what? Just walking around being friendly to people. <laughs> hey, uh, the only way I can exit is going back the way I did? Or, or these exits? Perfect, perfect, perfect. Cool. He's just about to walk out that door right oh, yeah. there. He would have been gone. We got this gentleman here lurking. He was the one lurking. But. Is there a reason for the camera, sir? You gotta, you gotta do that? Bring your nose in someone else's business? Nope. You don't have to. He was just about out the door. So he got challenged, he decided to remain silent. But the cops have already been called. That was a nod to the good? police. Oh, What's the name? stream picked up. What's your name? And here's the over the shoulder thing. Can you tell your name? Non confrontational. All right. Come on, let's go. Can't. Oh, Come on, let's go. contact right there. Now I see this, I'm watching at home, and I'm like, boom, I'm calling. I'm Come calling him up. Come on. Sir, Come on. He's remaining silent. Not Come on. following. Can you tell me your name? Will you tell me your name? Look at you that one. You say your name or anything? Jesus. Dude. Let's go outside, please. You gotta get on the treadmill, okay. kid. If they don't want you here, and they say you're trespassing, then you're illegally arrested for trespassing, or you can go outside. Illegal arrest, attempt number one. Over the shoulder filming, remaining silent. Go outside so you don't have to go to jail. You gotta go outside so you don't have to go to jail. Another threat. Just a lie. Just a total lie. I don't want to take you to jail, but if you go outside. That's four times right. he's mentioned jail. Have I been asked to leave? Are you asking me to leave? I asked you what was it. Are you asking me to leave? How can we help you? Are you asking me to leave? How can we help you? They won't. Are you, are you asking me to leave or not? They won't answer. How can we help you? You can help me by answering my question. Are you asking me to leave or not? First of all, how can we help you? You can help me by leaving me alone. Express desire to be left yeah. alone. What's your name and badge number? Oh, it's a blessing. Yeah, you know better. Are you asking me to leave? <laughs> if we cannot service you anything, yes. All right, guys, this is Steve Collins with the Grand Prairie City. He is the code enforcement manager. So you're, you're, what are you asking me to leave for? If we cannot service you with your needs, what do you, what, how can we help you? You can help me by leaving me alone. Okay. But at this point, then, if we cannot help you, then, all right, would you leave? Are you asking me to leave? Yes. You know this is public property, right? Yes, it is. But if Who's your manager? Christy Martinez. Can you please bring her here? Sir, what is this all about? This is about you you trying to use force. This guy has already touched me on camera. Okay? He shook his head, yes. bullying me in a public space. That's what it's about. Calling out the violence. There's about 120 people watching you right now. <laughs> yeah, it is fine. So can you articulate why you're asking me to leave a public space? Is there any code compliance issues that you have with us? No. Is that a yes or a no? I'm asking you. I'm asking you. I don't answer questions. I'm asking you. How can we help you? You can help me by leaving me alone and letting me do my business. Okay. I'll leave you alone. Thank you. <laughs> What's up, Mac? They called you too, Mac? 
<laughs> Matt. Three cops. They're gonna they're gonna get you all the way over here. They couldn't leave you on your post. Do you know who this young man is in front of me right here? Matt. Matt. Matt, you gonna ignore me? Now the police are ignoring him. <laughs> Alright guys, so this is um Mark is on the scene. They brought this gentleman on the scene as well. And this one's the one that uh assaulted me on camera. There were 120 people watching. Calling the cop Mac by a nickname or a first name. Well done. They don't have a clue what to do. <laughs> All because some woman got scared. Oh, he scares me with his camera. Get him removed by guns and force. All I have to do is leave him alone. He's a really friendly guy. You asking me to leave? Are you asking me to leave? Are you asking me to leave? Where are you here? Is that a yes or a no? How can the city help you? You can help me by leaving me alone, and you've already agreed to let me uh, to leave me alone. So why are you back? Why are you not doing your job? Yeah. Do you have any evidence that I'm a citizen? Okay. Are you a citizen? Are you a lawyer? Yeah. 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 You know who Megan Mahan is? Yeah, you'll be hearing from her. <laughs> yeah, it is all right. This is so awesome. <sighs> oh, here's, oh, here we go. So we got one, four, two, three. Four. Can I watch this guy? Oh. At this point, we just got another one called. We started filming as we came in. Take it easy, Mac. My Mac leaves. There's no reason for me to be here. I. I Black guy's trying to get him arrested. He's trying to get him removed by force. Bunch of white officers to do his dirty work for him. Interesting. This is what initiated it, guys. Interesting. If he just would have, you can do. You, you can leave me alone. That's what you can do. You can go back to doing your job. That's what you can do. Yeah. He was gone. Yeah. Stop standing there on my tax dollars. <laughs> doing nothing. <laughs> I'm not angry about anything. He needs him to be. Sitting here staring at someone on my tax dollar doing nothing. <laughs> Are you asking me to leave? Well, if the city can offer you. Is that a yes or a no? Well, right now you seem to be threatening. Us. Are you asking me to leave? I'm simply asking you. I'm simply asking you an easy question. Are you asking me to leave? We have no services for you. Is that a yes or a no, Steve Collins? Do we have any services for you? So you're not asking me to leave, or you are asking me to leave? Do we have any services to offer you? This is pointless and circular. Are you qualified to ask me to leave? Are you qualified to ask me any questions? The city employee should, you be, are? should be doing something different. Do you have any credentials to even speak to me? I'm not understanding the nature of your behavior. Of course you don't understand. It doesn't look like you understand. At this point, if we can't offer you any services, you're asking me to leave. Will you leave? Are you asking me to leave? I'm asking you to leave. So you're asking, you're officially asking me to leave we public don't, property. Don't know why you're here? It doesn't matter. Okay, well, your job is not to figure out why I'm here. I answered your question. I'm asking. What's your job your description? I'm the manager of code compliance. Yeah, so go, go back to doing your job. job. <laughs> yeah. Has no clue what public property is, and he's sitting here. Yeah, go back. There you go. There you go. There you go. <laughs> who's leaving? Who's the one who's leaving? Now he wants him to take him out. Is this filming a crime? Nope. All right. Not doing a crime. All right. Go back to doing your job. Go on. You're dismissed. <laughs> You're just missed. That makes you happy. Alright. You just say what's going on? Hey, what's going on? 
talk to me at all? Did he talk to me? Remaining silent, man. Way to go. He's just trying to find a path to remove you by force. And by not talking, you don't give him that path. They're trained to talk. Now he doesn't know what to do. He just knows there's a camera on him. He doesn't want to make any mistakes. If I sit here and do and say nothing, the boss can't get too mad at me for that. I have a hard time filing any kind of lawsuit if I just sit here and do nothing. This guy's sitting there and doing nothing. But at least he's farther away. There's no reason to be any close. Two to three feet. That's danger zone close. Yeah, yeah, they will learn today. What's up? I'm sorry to hear you. He was talking to a commenter on his stream. Oh no, I'm losing some. Let me put this on pause. Darn it. Oh no, it's still working. What the heck? Oh, the stream went a little bit. The connection to the stream got a little poor. That's why. <gasps> no, don't pause. Doesn't know what to do. Sit there and scratching his first chin. Look at that nice haircut, man. Clean shave. Well groomed statist. You got an idea on you? <laughs> you got an idea on you? Yes, the cop, but he's got an idea. That's hilarious. <laughs> Sir, you have an idea on you? Now the cop's the one remaining silent. Wow. Cop's usually the one doing the talking. Now he's got the cop being so the one. So are you refusing to ID yourself to me? Remaining silent. You have an ID on you? You have an ID on you? Don't look at your buddy, he ain't gonna help you. For this day, man, four cameras, they would just, at the small of your back, push you out of the building. And if you offered any resistance, they'd just take you to the ground, hopefully with a concussion. Not these days, buddy. Not these days, huh? Irrefutable truth capturing accountability right there in the palm of your hand. Sir, you have an ID on you? My name is Officer Brian 419. Appreciate that, Brian. See? Complied? Appreciate that. So, what's what's the plan? What's, I'm just asking you. What, you what's you, the plan today? You have an ID on you? I have an ID, but I'm not showing you my ID. My ID is Jerry Bryant 419. That's all you need to know. What's the plan here? Are you just going to film film us? What, what's the game plan? We got a Mexican standoff here. <laughs> is, this, is this all you're going to do? The more time that goes by, the more t every second proves that these cops are powerless. Their will is not happening. What they want isn't happening. What they were called to do is not happening. They're wasting everyone's time. Just because some secretary got scared. By the way, that's the number one call of cops coming out is a scared woman. And the white knight syndrome kicks in and oh, here I come to the rescue. That cop's right there beating. He ain't gonna do nothing. The other one... <clears throat> the other one's still doing some investigating over here, asking some questions. He's probably gonna help train those folks over there and end this, get Bow out. He's gonna coordinate with them, whisper, whisper. Okay, I'm gonna do this and say this. You can back me up in this way. 
you say this on the record, I'll file a report and you and I'll put that you said this. Does that sound like a good plan? Yes, it does. Let's get him out of here. Okay, great. I'm going to go up to him and threaten him with violence, bully him a little bit, see if we can't make that work. All right? Like a football huddle. Ready, break. They're having a private convo about me. Yep, they sure are. So now he breaks um, it up for him. Stay right there. So, um, right now, since he's just kind of in the public area, let him do, get bored doing whatever his thing is. Okay. You know, obviously, he can't go back in the security area. Sure. If he interferes with any customers that come in here from y'all being able to do y'all's business, we're going to take care of him at that point. Okay, good. Otherwise, he can Facebook Live all, all his stuff to whoever. Okay. To his four followers. Yeah. Do you understand that? Do you understand that? I need, I need a yes or no. Way too close. Do you understand that? Way oh. too close. Do you understand He that? just touched me, guys. Do you understand so that? If you go. interfere with any customers here, Chest poking type we'll be called back, okay? Like it's high school. You can film all you want to in this public area, okay? All right, so I've got two you understand that? camera now. Do you understand? I'm taken by your silence that you understand me and the fact that you just looked at me. So don't interfere with any of the business here, okay? Do you understand me? <laughs> Such pretty baby blues. I'm taking that as a yes. There we go, Lockie Shane. Uh, another lazy employee. Like I said, Mr. if he interferes okay. or threatens anybody, we'll come take care of him at that point with you. So, at 5 o'clock, they lock, they lock up, you have to leave. If you don't leave, you will be arrested. Keep walking. At 5 o'clock, that's two hours. There you go. Go ahead, Cloak and officer. Who's leaving? Who's leaving? Anyone Good getting arrested? Please. Nope. Anyone getting arrested? No. Nope. All right, so I just got, uh, that guy just assaulted me as well. <laughs> um, I don't know what video it is, but. I cannot put it's, uh, hands it's, on it's, it's, it's uh, basically at, uh, you said I can't go out this door, right, ma'am? And as soon as you they're over, out he door. leaves. Yeah. Yeah. This is what you, all yeah. you city administrators need to learn. All right. So, um. Is that if you just let him go about his business. <laughs> but yeah. And not yeah, harass yeah, yeah. him. He just but, leaves. Um, it's over. All right. He tried to pull the blue oh, yeah, car. Just, uh, he just assaulted me. Uh, both of them did actually. Yeah, the, the guy just put his hand on me. Uh, both of them put. Their yeah, you try to use the bully card. That's what happens. You're gonna get confronted, embarrassed, really. So just let him go about his business. And uh, that was obviously some uh, awesome cop watching by Bao. Totally de-escalate. Totally stay calm. Totally uh, document everything. No fear, right? Zero fear. And dude's solid. Dude's solid. Alright, that's the end of this uh, video for me. Hope you enjoyed it. Later.